Warning, this video may contain graphic content such as sexual scenes, violence, gore, boobies, and the rest of the fun stuff. Unfortunately, YouTube won't allow that, so we'll try what we can. Please be over 18 to view this video, and don't say we didn't warn you. Endlessly searching for an original scene. Hey guys, welcome back to more of Paprika Trainer. So, um, I'm gonna be trying some stuff to fix this. Um, it was supposed to trip something, so let's try to trip it. Yes, new guy? On it. Yes, new guy. Understood. Let's see. It's been the day exploring the city. Hmm. You look around the ravaged buildings. Looks like this is a bad neighborhood even before the riots. Look around, you notice a red dot right before your feet. Sniper! You dodge out of the way and cover your head with your arms. Carefully peeking through an eye, you see the red dot still appearing on the ground, flashing on and off. Is that Morse code? On, off, on, off, on, off. SOS, trapped rubble. So we have seen this one. Now we can actually set it off. Oh wait, he's got a face now. Yay! He's got a face. Clover's been the day working at the milkshake bar. There we go. So, what we did was basically, um, now I think it gets, no, Clover, no, can't do that. Nope. Alright, let's just, uh, go to bed. Night's quiet, da da da. Yes, new guy? There we go. Got it. Hey, Matthias, could you hack into a database for me? I could. What do you want? Access to secure files in the Whoop network. The Whoop network? Man, that's risky. You can't do it? Of course I can do it. But, I'll, but it'll take time and I got other priorities right now. Okay, how much? How much what? Money. How much money do you want for it? Huh. I'll do it for free, my dude. But you gotta be patient. Patience is not my strong suit. Is there something else you want? Some dirty mags, maybe? I got the internet, you know. If you can get the bikini model to show up on my front door, I promise you to move it to the priority list. Now you're gonna have to be patient. A bikini model? I could probably convince my spy to wear a bikini. He doesn't know that I'm not actually part of Whoop and that we're trying to take back the city to restore order. Uh, yeah, that sounds like a great idea. I'll have my spy show up here wearing a bikini. Have him back hack, have him back him hack into Whoop mainframe and get those database entries, dude. Meanwhile, keeping him completely in the dark, no need to drag this kid into a war between the forces of good and evil. You know I can hear everything you're saying, right? Did I say all that out loud? Pretty much. Damn it. I need to be more careful in the future. I might make this kid an accomplice in our borderline illegal plot to retake the city. Still talking out loud. Crap. Okay, you get busy hacking the Whoop network if I can get you a bikini model. You'll speed things up? You got a deal? See ya, dude. Latest. <laughs> All right. Yes, new guy? You got it. Yes, new guy? <laughs> you got it. Let's see. Yes. You exchange your coupon and get a strawberry smoothie. I do like smoothies. Well, strawberries. So that needs a thousand. Oh! You are one expensive ass bikini. Alright. I see how you doing this. I see how you doing this. You pass the market. It looks deserted with only one of two brave merchants around. Okay, we've seen this before. Sam spent the day working in the milkshake bar. So, what we're gonna have to do. There we go. As long as I got some bikinis, I could send someone over to Matthias for a research boost. 
Girls, could you come in here for a second? So, what the fuck is that? 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 What the fuck? I'm a, I, hold on. Right. It, it sounds like you're asking about... Sounds like you're about to ask us to do something. Put on a bikini. Huh? You want me to... What? Put on a bikini and head to this address. Don't ask why. Are you kidding? Of course I'm gonna ask why. There's a guy who promised to hack into Whoop Network, but only if he gets a bikini model. And what about the fact I'm not a model? Are you joking? Anyone can be a model nowadays. Just put on a bikini and go take a few pictures of yourself. New guy, I don't appreciate you renting me out like this. I got excited for a moment there when you asked about being a model. Being a stripper for some sweaty nerd to oogle is so not glamorous. What are we even supposed to do once we get there? I don't know. Stand around looking hot, do some poses, compliment the guy on his collection of hard drives, get creative. Well, I appreciate the suggestion, but I'll not be doing it. I already had an embarrassing enough over these last few days. I don't want to turn into a sex object for people to gawk at. Please let me just make it insane. Sam, he's going to help us break into the Whoop database. With his help, we'll access new gadgets and equipment. It'll take it'll make a it'll make missions a lot easier to have some extra tech on our side. Hmm. So you expect me to entertain to entertain some nerdy loner by shaking my ass a bit? I find this there is di very disrespectful, new guy. You said it, Sammy. But but if it'll help us take back Whoop, I guess I'll do it. Hmm. <clears throat> Just think about it, Clover. What if they start bringing out their big guns? We need gadgets to stand a chance. I don't like it, but new guy... I don't like it, new guy, but for the safety of the world, I'll do it. Fine. As long as he doesn't take pictures and upload them to his blog or something, I can't be seen around people like him. It would ruin my reputation. That's the spirit. I might, I might send you out tomorrow. Oh, and Sam? It wouldn't hurt to smile once you get there. Fine. You can now send the girls to Matthias's during the day to boost his research. Only spies that have swimsuits are available to go. This is entirely optional, however. Matthias will continue to work on the hacking without the help of the spies visiting him. We're sending their asses to visit him. You know we're doing it. Yes, new guy? On it! Yes, new guy? Yes. Understood. Let's go exploring. You spend the day exploring the city. Glass shattering. Hmm? Turn around the corner and see a group out. We've seen this before, so let's skip that. Hmm. Already too late. I already posted it on their social media. Oh, we're never going to live this down. You decide to head off and leave the outsiders behind. <coughs> oh my god, it's the one that... Yeah, it's from Lily. It's from Lily. Matha I'm back from Matthias's place. Well, how was it? I guess it wasn't that bad. Matthias seemed surprised when I showed up. Apparently he didn't think you were serious when you promised him a bikini model. Hey, I stick to my word. Sometimes. So how does research go? Good, actually. I ended up serving him soda and chips in my bikini, and he was more than happy to repay the favor, so to speak. Anyways, he said that he had a breakthrough and that you should visit him tomorrow. I might just do that. Well done, Sam. Well, I, uh, I didn't actually do anything, but thanks, I guess. Not looking forward to doing it more often. Clover spent the day working at the milkshake bar. Does Clover make more money at the milkshake bar? Seems like she does. Let's go visit Sam. Okay. Remember, this is still a work in progress, so we can't really. I am. I am alpha tester. Yes, new guy. Yes, new guy. Understood. Yes, new guy. You got it. Good news, my buddy. I managed to crack the blueprint inside the database. It's equipment, something called a VIB. 
Check your crafting bench to make it. If you need any materials to craft it, stop by, alright? Not in yet. Okay, so... Let's see, what items do we have? We have that, that's good. Might have enough to craft it. Voting Whoop Database. Oh, fuck you. Really? Vital Indication Bug, aka Vibe, or Viv unlocked. The Viv will measure a spy's oxytocin level and nanobot control via the status screen. It can also be used during missions to make a nano controlled spy come to her senses. Careful, however, using the VIB during missions can give away the spy's location. I bet the girls are gonna love this. Once I have a moment, I should go talk to them. Yep. Alright, so. Oh, we could have done a mission. No, you know what? Let's not until... We get to the, um, we get to it. Because I don't know if there's, like, a mission buried. Let's see. There we go. Okay, how am I going to tell them? Be honest and straightforward with them? I know I shouldn't voice in my head, but you know how, how they're going to react. They will probably say some nasty things to you, but just remember, I am a strong, independent man, and my ego is strong enough to handle some mean remarks by teenage girls. Yeah, thanks, voice. By the way, are you supposed to be my conscience or something? Also, if the girls refuse to say mean things to refuse and say mean things to you, you should strap them down to the bed and perform Chinese water torture on them. I like the voice. I think the voice is me. Definitely not my conscience. New guy, did I hear you talking to someone? Girls, I figured out a solution to our little nanobot problem. I present with. <laughs> I present with you, I present with you with, what? The V.I.B. You hold up two toys to the girls. Is that a toy? I don't see how this is going to be you, to help us, new guy. Er, Sam? Sam picks up the toy and inspects it. So, is this like a gadget? <laughs> Why is it vibrating? Hmm? No, no way. Is this... We're supposed to... You expect us to... I... Uh, Clover, say something. Ooh, it has five higher settings. Clover. Oh, Sam, calm down. It's just a vibrator. But... But it's naughty. Listen, Sam. We're not little girls anymore. We're full-blown spies. Working for one of the most powerful organizations on Earth. If anything, I'm surprised we haven't run into something like this before. But... I mean, don't get me wrong. Did you have to go with such a gaudy pink new guy? That's like, so not fashionable. Just deal with it, Sam. It's not like he's going to ask us to wear it on to a mission. Right? R right? New guy, this is not funny. Not only will you wear it on a mission... You'll also wear it when going undercover. Hmm? Hmm? And when you're at the base. That's... And not only that. There's more. <laughs> it's remote controlled. Whenever I suspect any of you are turning traitorous, I can use this to snap you out of it. He has a point. Clover, don't give in so easily. It's either this or help... Or helping in overthrowing the world. There has to be another way. I'm sure there is. But we sort on a tight deadline here. Well, we could. How about instead we... I'm sure if we... Give me one of those. Clover takes one of the vibes and heads into the nearby room. This is stupid. You can't order us around like this. I'm your boss. I'm pretty sure I can. No, you can't. We're not your slaves. 
You we might as well be at this point. Clover. If we're going to save the world, like it or not, we need him. But... And he knows it. He can ask us to do whatever he wants. Y you wouldn't do that. W would you? You want me to say something crazy because you gave me the option for it. I could order you to do all kinds of sick things. Huh? I mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't, but I could. Oh. At least I probably wouldn't. New guy? Nah. Okay, real talk. I would totally make you do all the weird stuff. I could turn your cell into a dungeon. No. Or more likely, just have you do all my boring stuff, like file my taxes. I still don't like it. Like it or not, we're at his whims, and it's going to be up to him to decide how he treats us. New guy, you got a lot of power over us now, okay? But we're still people. Forcing us to do things we don't want to do will have a negative impact. Gloves treating us like slaves and overworking us will affect our mood. Now hang on, now hang on a minute. You don't have to treat us like slaves. I bet we could become great friends if you don't abuse your power too much. I guess we'll see. For now, go put on the vibe. I'm just saying vibe. Fine. So, you found this thing in the Whoop database? Yep. Always knew that Jerry was secretly a perv. Jerry's the founder of Whoop, right? Yeah, the fact that we hadn't been heard of anything about him makes me sort of worried. I hope that nothing bad happened to him. Got sorted? What do you think? Good, let's test these out. Beep. Huh? Oh. Judging by your reactions, looks like they work. And these will measure our vital signs? Yep, got them right here. It says you're aroused. New guy, can you please turn it off? Oh, right, sorry. All right, we'll be we'll done, girls. Head back to yourselves for now. We'll get busy to we we'll got we got a busy day tomorrow. The girls nod and take their leave. Yay! So with that, guys, we will end this episode. Thank you so much for joining me for more Paprika Trainer. I once again want to thank the developer for allowing me to alpha test this game, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Thank you.